Hi guys, it's Chinavasta here. Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here to this channel, welcome. I publish Star Wars content every Friday. Make sure to subscribe so that you don't miss any of my videos. Theories discussed in this video might be spoilers for episode 9, so be aware and proceed with caution. So theories surrounding Han Solo's death have been spreading all over the internet since the release of The Force Awakens. I also published a Star Wars Episode 9 prediction theory in which I do discuss Han Solo's death and Kylo Ren's knowledge and the secrets. So if you wish to watch that video first, I will link it down below. Many people believe that Kylo Ren killed his own father by luring him closer to him, putting an end to his misery. However, I personally believe that he did not kill Han Solo. I believe Han Solo actually ignited the lightsaber himself so to spare his son from this horrible act. Um, he knew that his son had struggles and so he wanted to spare him from this horrible act by committing the act himself. So the theme of patricide has been beautifully captured by Sophocles Oedipus in which King of Thebes hears of a prophecy um, that his infant son will one day kill him. So he lives his infant son to die on a mountainside as a result. Now Hanso has always recognized his son's um, tendency towards the dark side and potential for the dark side therefore we must say that he kind of abandoned him he's never been present in his son's life because he saw too much vader in him so when ansel sees his son as star killer base he barely recognizes him based on knowledgeization doubt no father wants to acknowledge that his son has grown to be a man in fact his son wants to exceed the father's and Davies, the father's accomplishments, but also succeed where the father has failed. However, if indeed the son killed his own father, the son becomes automatically a future father who will also be killed by his own son. So that creates a chain reaction. But Kylo Ren does not really fit that psychology because of his desperate need for love. Also, based on myth, when a son metaphorically kills his own father, he should be gaining strength, power. In the myth, actually, patricide is considered a breaking point in a son's life that signifies power, victory, and glory. But after Kaloran killed, presumably killed Han Solo, he's actually looking weakened and restrained by that event. And also he starts showing gratitude towards Han Solo. He says thank you after committing murder. That doesn't make any sense. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Ciao!